Welcome to St. Paul and for joining us for the Red Zone and Pearson's Candy Productivity and Food Quality Event. It's been around since uh, 1909. We've had Red Zone since 2018. The nice thing about Red Zone is you can keep your current processes, but you can tag on a very modern jump. One of the big things that we really launched us forward was when we added compliance. Uh, by moving all of that sort of legwork and things like that of, of quality people just constantly doing rounds. Now Red Zone does the rounds, the operators are doing the checks, and quality is coming around and doing quality assurance. It, it kind of almost gamifies it a little bit into, hey, we're competing in a fun way, and you guys as, as the executive teams, you know, you can you can translate that those productivity gains to your PL. We had one shift that was producing 30,000 pounds more a shift than any other shift. And when one of our other shifts beat them, to see them walk around and bragging about it because they could see it right there was like the most rewarding thing. And if you're looking here, you're looking at other stuff. The piece that we have found to be very different is the Reds and coaches. I can't speak highly enough about the coaching and the onboarding. It um, is such a beneficial piece to the process. They understand what day-to-day -day manufacturing life is. Coffee prices are more than double the price per raw pound today than they were last year at this time. There's no price hikes against our competitors. We have to hold price. The only way you know, we can essentially stay viable and continue is, is to keep optimizing what we can control. And this gives us all the tools to do that and it's reduced the wrong packaging hold. Our goal last year was a 10% reduction and we had a 100% reduction. I think it also highlights some of your un unsung heroes. You'll find your rock stars really quickly and chances are it's not someone you've ever thought of before. 